how, uh, how, how was the bye week productive to get some rest? I think it was good for us. You know, we had some physical games. I thought it worked out for us. Um, you know, able to prepare for Tulane but, and also get some rest. How was Keenan doing? I just talked to him. He seemed like he was ready to go full go this week. I mean, I, I think it helped him to yeah. recover. Uh, you know, we tried to push the pace a little bit at practice today. We still got a lift. But we wanted to make sure we had a good practice, and I thought he looked good. And then t no no restrictions on his practicing the rest of the week? No, he's got to go. You know, we, we limited him last week. You know, he really didn't do much last week. You know, so it was good. The bye came at a good time. He was able to get a lot of rest. Gave them a weekend off, but we got to go today. So what's kind of the mentality now that the ACC season is kind of starting in earnest? I mean, it's exciting. Yeah. It's exciting to be in the league. It's exciting to be in a league that's doing well. You know, we're really excited to play Tulane. Uh, so, you know, when, when you have a bye and you don't get to play, especially after a loss, you know, you want to get that bad taste out of your mouth. And, you know, we're looking forward to, you know, playing well against Tulane. Uh, you know, we know they have a lot of good players. You know, Coach, Coach Johnson's a good coach. I know they're trying to get things turned around. And, you know, we just got to make sure we're ready to go. When you see three teams from the American in the top 25, just speaks to the strength of the, the conference, does it not? Um, like I said, it's an exciting time. You know, the Temple's doing a great job. Memphis, uh, Houston, you know, and, you know, a lot of other teams are, are better now and doing well. So it's a competitive conference. Guys are doing really well. And, you know, like I said, not as, only is it exciting to be in the AAC, but to see other guys doing well is exciting. As far as Tulane goes, can you talk a little about what challenges they present? Well, you know, like everybody else, I mean, a lot of good players, a lot of good athletes. Their front, defensive front is as athletic as we're going to see. Mm -hmm. You know, big physical guys. Uh, like I said, you know, they've, you know, they're going through some adjustments. You know, they had some injuries. The quarterback wasn't able to play last week. You know, we're not sure if he's going to play this week, their starter. Um, you know, we just got to make sure that we're ready to go. We looked at the Notre Dame tape. What are some of the corrections that you wanted to make or want to make? Well, you know, first and foremost, obviously taking care of the football. Yeah. Um, you know, we had some missed assignments. I think we got, we thought we were prepared for the noise, but we weren't. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? We had to call some timeouts early on in the game that we normally don't like to do. Uh, but, you know, it, it disrupted us, but it's no excuse. You know, we have to play better. But on both sides of the ball, we could have played much better as far as assignments. And we just wish we could have played better against a you know a really good team. But right now, you know, all of our focus is on two in. Thanks, Ken. Appreciate it. Thanks, yes, Coach. Did you did you go at all last Thursday, Friday? Did you practice at all? Uh I did some some my some my fundamental drills, some individual drills and uh, you know, just other than that I was just taking mental reps. Yeah. And the plan this week is to full go or what Yeah, I was full go today at practice, it'll be full go for the rest of the week. Just how was the bye week overall for the team? Did you guys get rest? Did you get productive bye week? It was huge, you know, we had three really, really physical teams. Um, even four, you know, four really physical teams. Um, it was a tough stretch, and we got an even tougher stretch coming up. Um, it, so we, we needed this week to get healthy, get everybody back, and uh, get ready for the, for the long haul. Yeah, what's well, kind of like the, the mentality, knowing that now it's the AAC season really in, in earnest here coming up? Um, I don't think anything's changed. It's like, I, like I always say, the keys to winning are always the same. You know, we're just focusing on, you know, limiting the turnovers, taking care of the football, and, you know, doing our jobs on offense and let the rest take care of itself. And as far as Tulane goes, um, what, do you, what, what makes them a challenge, do you think? Very athletic. I mean, you know, they got a lot of DBs running around. Um, they make a lot of plays, cause a lot of havoc. You know, watching Georgia Tech film cause a lot of turnovers um, just by their pure speed and athleticism. So, uh, you know, we, we definitely got to be very conscious of that going into Saturday.